All right, let's take a look here. Your weather headlines as we go through the next couple of days. We had the rain for the morning, but now we're going to clear things out as we go through the rest of your afternoon and into your evening hours. More sunshine expected. Now, as we go into the evening, clear skies. Same deal overnight tonight with the clear skies, but turning breezy. And if you've been outside over the last hour, hour and a half, the winds have picked up and they will continue to pick up through the rest of your afternoon. Now, it was raining this morning, as I mentioned, but the winds were calm right now as the rain and that front moved away. The winds are starting to pick up and that wind comes from that cold air direction and brings us the cold air as we go into tonight into tomorrow. Then we warm up next week. Now Monday, Tuesday, we're in the 60s. Wednesday, we're in the 70s. As we go into your Thursday, Friday, we'll have to watch for some rain really late Wednesday into your Thursday and Friday. Here's the rain from the morning. It's off in the Atlantic, continuing to push away from us, still dealing with some clouds in our viewing area, but quickly racing away as the clear skies and high pressure start to move on in. You know what that means? I mean, here we are just shy of 1, 1 p.m. 1 a.m., right? <laughs> 1 p.m., and we're going to continue to uh, clear things out, and we'll see a lot of sunshine through the rest of the afternoon. And again, the clear skies will continue for tonight, and tomorrow features wall-to-wall -wall sunshine as well. But tomorrow also features this breezy wind from this northerly direction. So our temperatures tomorrow struggle. In fact, in the morning we wake up with 20s in the afternoon only in the 40s, but it will feel colder than that. Here you go through the afternoon hours again. Wall to wall sunshine, breezy gust to 20 miles per hour with that northerly wind tomorrow. North uh, easterly wind at times and again, it'll just be a chilly day tomorrow, uh, but the winds do relax as the day goes on. I think the breeziest time will be in the morning. And then as the afternoon goes on, the winds do relax some. We'll start to see a few clouds filter in as we go into your evening, especially overnight Saturday into Sunday. Uh, but Sunday is a mostly cloudy day with a couple spot showers. For the rest of the day today, though, this is pretty much it for our temperatures. We're in the low 50s now, and we're not going to be warming up anymore. And actually, we'll actually start to see these temperatures drop a bit over the next couple of hours and into your evening. We certainly drop like a rock. And again, it's all because of this wind. Look at Bishopville, 14 miles per hour. Winsboro at 18 miles per hour. Same deal in Lexington and Newberry, 18 miles per hour. But notice the arrows north, 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 uh, northwest, north. That was a cold air direction. And again, that's why our temperatures will start to drop as we go into, of course, the rest of the day today. As far as these gusts, we're going to gust to around 20, 25 miles per hour, maybe at the most, but I think 20 miles per hour will do it for most spots through the rest of the afternoon. And then the winds do calm as we go, of course, into the day tomorrow. First alert, 10 day forecast, lots of sunshine for the rest of the day today, lots of sunshine for tomorrow. And then as we go into your Sunday, let's watch, of course, for a few spotty showers with temperatures in the 50s turning warmer next week.